Thank you for watching KHSD News. I'm Erin Briscoe Clark. The Kern High School District is excited to kick off Hispanic Heritage Month, which is celebrated from September 15th to October 15th. This year's theme is Hispanic Americans, a history serving our nation. Hispanics do a lot of things here in America and around the world. We do a lot of things, they do a lot of things. They work, they build houses, they build schools, hospitals. They, had, they have a lot of impact in here in America. I think Hispanic Heritage Month, it's the opportunity to learn and show the beauty from different cultures. It's like revisiting history, it's being proud of your roots. Um, Hispanic Heritage Month, month it's the time to um, show and think what other Hispanics have done, what they have accomplished. Um, I think it also helps stop negative stereotype. And I think most important for our students at Golden Valley and for myself, it's a way to say thank you to our parents for um, leaving their country and coming here for a better future. It's important to celebrate diversity, to get a little bit known about other people's cultures and know about more around the world. I think it's important to celebrate diversity because we all need to know about where our friends have came from and just our peers in general. Someone I admire or look up to in history is Cesar Chavez because he was a, a leader of the uh, United Farm Workers, and he, he was, uh, my grandparents knew him personally. My mom and my grandparents knew him personally, and they were part of the, the movement that he did, and I think that he made a really big impact in um, the United States. Over the next month, we will be celebrating and recognizing the rich history and contributions made by Hispanic and Latinx individuals. Be sure to check out our website, kernhigh.org, where we will share stories, videos, and celebrations from across the district. A Frontier Titan is stepping up to give back to those less fortunate. Phoebe Wynn's garage looks more like a shoe closet these days. The Frontier ASP president has teamed up with the nonprofit Souls for Souls to collect new and gently worn shoes. They collect shoes and also clothes, but I'm just doing a shoe drive. And it's to provide children and adults with items that they need to meet certain dress code requirements to achieve an education or help prevent um, diseases from unsanitary conditions and then also help boost their self-esteem as well. Phoebe learned of the nonprofit last year and loved its mission. She laced up her shoes and hit the pavement and started her own drive, collecting around 100 pairs of shoes. This year, she set her goals higher, but after only two weeks, she surpassed that goal. So she decided to extend her drive to the end of this month with hopes of collecting 500 pairs of shoes. It's really personal. It becomes more of a personal thing when you really see where everything is going. And I feel like with shoes especially, something again that you take for granted and it's something that could totally mean the world to somebody else and you really see these children, these young kids that they have to worry about having a pair of shoes or a shirt on their back or something like that and it does truly mean a lot. For more information on how you can donate, Phoebe created the Instagram account s4s.baco. It's really rewarding and it makes me really happy to not only be able to oversee this drive but also to see so many people get involved. Kern Valley High School is currently home base for firefighters across the country as they battle wildfires in our state. To mark the 19th anniversary of the September 11th terror attacks, firefighters paused to remember the thousands of lives lost on the tragic day in history. For a few of the firefighters who had volunteered from New York, the day hit close to home. A family in the area also stopped by to personally thank firefighters for the sacrifices they make to ensure our communities stay safe. From the Kern High School District, we would like to say thank you. And finally, West High School staff got out the green and gold and hit the road Thursday. Staff members set off on a shout-out route, driving through neighborhoods in the area to spread Viking pride. They say it was a small way to say hello to their students and let them know that they miss them and hope to see them back in the classroom soon. 
Thank you for watching KHSD News. To stay connected with what's happening across the district, don't forget to follow us on Twitter at KHSD underscore official. We'll see you again next week.